Lime SDR is essentially consisting of our new generation of transceiver uh, technology. Uh, covers from 100 kilohertz to 3.8 gigahertz, together with an FPGA from Altera and a microcontroller that interfaces this board uh, via USB 3 to a computer. Lime is in the business of um, producing software-defined radio solutions and bring the same level of programmability we have in digital domain into the RF. Here at Ubuntu, we are super excited about the Lime SDR because we think the Lime SDR is brilliant for any developer doing wireless uh, communication development. Developers will be able to take any wireless standard and package it as an app and then put it in an app store so that anybody will be able to use it. That means that through a normal USB interface, USB APIs, open software, everything is open source, I can go and define any radio stack that I want. This is also operating at the core of this box right here, which is running Snappy Ubuntu Core. So from Snappy Ubuntu Core, one application becomes the LTE stack. So now you have an e -Node B or a base station basically at your home or in your premises, enterprise, ready for use, just by buying low-cost hardware, using our store and downloading an LTE stack from the store. In the same way, you could download an 802.11 stack, you could download a LoRa, a Sixfox stack, whatever you want, as long as you can define it and think about it, you can write the software to drive that stack. This will enable you to make the jump into the next generation of connected devices because this will be sitting at the edge of the network and it's going to make something like a, an LTE base station app enabled. So you're ready to take the next step, put in there a Netflix cache, an Amazon Content Delivery Network replication node, an Akamai replication node, you name it. Getting behind the Lime SDR campaign could mean you will develop the equivalent of Angry Birds in wireless communications. Please join us.